Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome back to my own personal moon. We're playing some more Icarus tonight, continuing on with our uh, open world gameplay that we have. Uh, I picked up a new mission right at the end of the last stream from the mission board that we have set up, because with the open world game, you got that mission board you can get things from. You know what I mean. Anyway, we're going to try and like triangulate some sort of a base that's out there somewhere and place this beacon down so they can find it. Uh, it doesn't seem like it's going to be super hard. I guess we'll see what happens, uh, and then we might end up, end up tackling multiple missions tonight. To make a little more progress, try to build some more of the machines, get up to that tier 4 stuff now that I have the titanium that we picked up the last time when we were in the, uh, the volcanic biome. And, uh, I don't know, just have some more survival fun. Welcome everybody who's here in the chat so far, or if you're watching on the channel afterwards, welcome as well. Uh, as always, a huge thanks to everyone who's clicked on the join button. I really do appreciate all the support from everyone. And a special thanks to all of our top tier Mistakes Are Made members that were highlighted right at the start of the stream. Uh, if you, uh, I know not everyone is in a position to click on that join button, but uh, just being here to enjoy the streams, watching the content afterwards, clicking the subscribe button to uh, follow along with you know the progress of the channel and stuff, all that stuff helps too. So thanks to everybody. They're all fabulous people. This is my home, if you haven't seen it before. Uh, if you're here, you probably did see it before, but uh, this is what we got. Um, I do eventually want to relocate somewhere else and build a home out of like cement and steel and glass and make it all look fancy and modern with like a separate workshop and living area, but uh, that's not what we're focused on today. Uh, I do still need to get um, some more stuff, more things. Uh, we've got titanium ingots now started, so that will actually start to get us access to um, some of these other things. Actually, I think it's over here. There's this... Uh, Metals processor. I've got to get titanium plates for that. Uh, I think I actually need aluminum too. I don't know if I gathered any while I was out. I guess I did. I got a little bit there. So we'll take this with me over here. I think I make titanium plates in here. Yeah, there we go. Each of those require three titanium, so that's that's going to take a fair chunk of titanium, even just to make three of those plates. This weekend, we Icarus players get a smoker. Yes, a smoker. Who needs optimization anyhow? Yeah, no kidding, right? <laughs> what I find curious is they keep adding food to the game, but food is so minimal in this game, really. Like, your character doesn't get bored of what they're eating. You can just pick a couple things that have good traits on them, and then you're good to go. You know, there's not really, like, a lot of... a lot of food-required variety there. You can only have three things in, like three food buffs at a time anyway, so I think everyone, for the most part, I think people just sort of pick their favorites, and those are the ones they run with, like, most of the time. So it's interesting they're adding a smoker now, after having a drying rack and the regular cooking things. But well, whatever. Can't go wrong with a little barbecue, I guess. Um, what do I need to make more of the cream corn? Is it the water I don't have in here? Yeah, that's what it is. I'm trying to think I should build a, uh, Why is there a line at the bottom of that? These things don't have a durability, do they? It better not. If it does, I got problems. Wait, two. Only two. Oh, fat's not there. Somewhere here I have fat that I already had made. There it is. That's better. Is there smoked egg? There better not be evil eggs. Ugh. The only eggs that are worth eating are Cadbury eggs. Or possibly those... Well, I guess they're still Cadbury eggs. Those little ones that are covered in, like, candy. Those are the ones you get at Easter time. Those ones are good, too. You have five food slots with your Planet Made armor. What you talking about five food slots? What do you mean five food slots? So instead of, like, having three status effects, you can have five of them? Which armor is that? I guess there is a benefit to having some of the planet-made armor, because of the uh, stuff on the station I've just been using, because, I mean, why not? It's better than everything else for the most part. Uh, it's not this one. Resistances and all that stuff. It's not the hunter one. So like a tier four, like uh, carbon fiber composite, something or other, obsidian maybe. On that one, carbon fiber armor. Physical resist explosion. No, didn't know these say it. I don't know. Whatever, doesn't matter. 
You just have to spec. You can get four food slots just as a spec in it. Oh, really? So that's under talents then, right? I guess that would be under cooking and farming. Plant the crops, shoot the breeze, or would that be under combat or something? Maybe get off my lawn, speed grow. Gives an extra food buff. Oh, there we go. Plus one space and stomach. That's pretty handy, actually. I don't know if that was there when I spent all my talent points. I don't know. There were too many to pick from, and I was like, I don't know. I'll just take stuff, and also maybe things. It's not a solo one, is it? Free steal from hunting? Nope. Oh, well. It is what it is. It's a talent to get the bigger stomach. Yeah, I just saw that. I found it. I'm a little slow, but I did find it. It's okay. I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. Alright, we're gonna make one of these uh, metal processor things. I'm gonna have to get some carbon fiber. We're gonna need, wow, a bunch of electronics. Uh, I've got plenty of gold. I think the copper might be the limiting factor on the uh, electronics. I need 60 of them. So what was that? 300 of the gold wire I need. Fortunately, I have that gold deposit that's like right outside my base, so I've got a decent amount of gold here. That's how I got all this stuff. Where are we here? 60 of these? Can I make 60? Wow, I can make a, I can make a lot of them. Alright. Get those going. Oh, I need this uh, epoxy, I think. No, I didn't. Never mind. Maybe an armor upgrade? Yeah, apparently. IRL Cryptic Fox has multiple bigger stomach talents. IRL. Listen here, you. Are you making fun of my stomach? I think that's what you're doing there, and I don't, uh, I don't like it. Don't like it at all. I have got copper in here. That's weird. Copper in the advanced base in revenge. Sure. Makes sense. Slap that in there. Probably should repair my bow. It's looking a little, a little worse for wear. Oh, I still need to craft that repair bench too, so I can use the repair kits to fix my station-based stuff. Uh, repair badge. Cured leather, unless I have that here somewhere. Cured leather, refined wood, and stone. I don't think I made it already. I'm gonna look up here just in case, because I did make a lot of stuff. There's too many benches in this game. If, if that's one minor complaint I might have about this game, it's that there's just too many crafting benches. I don't think I have it. I gotta make it. So I gotta get cured leather. Is it snowing out here? What the heck? Okay, that's weird. Uh, what else do I need for cured leather? Just need more sap, I guess. Gotta have more tree sap. Not sappy enough. Give us a spiel about being the fuel tank for a love machine again? No. Can only go to the well so many times, you know. People stop believing. Even when you sing that song, don't stop believing. They still keep going. They just, just give it up on it. It's, it's no good. It's no good at all. Alright. More sap equals more cured leather. What else do I need for that silly thing? Uh, oh wait, uh, refined wood, right? Which I don't have, like, any in here, so let's... I don't know. Make a little bit of refined wood. That stuff's really slow crafting, unfortunately, so that's gonna take a little bit. Can't stop if we never believe in the first place. Fair enough. If I could sing better, I'd sing it, but it's I think it's out of my vocal range a little bit. 
Plus, my voice still is not entirely back to normal after being sick over Christmas. Also, don't want to strike. Yep, that too. <laughs> oh, stone I needed? I need that for the repair bench, right? Or, wait. Was it the repair bench I needed it for? Or... Yeah, it was. Refined wood and cured leather. Ugh, refined wood crafts so slowly. I need to get that other... There is an advanced carpentry bench that I'm sure makes it faster. Um, is that on here? Yes, it is. Also requires composites, so I can't make that yet. Got home of the hospital. Have what's that now? Hopefully, nothing too serious. Ah, oh. need epoxy. Need like half of this. I think it was eight of them I needed for here, right? Yeah, eight. Steel screws I have hiding somewhere. I don't know where I put them, but I got steel screws somewhere. There they are. Take those over here, too. When I get my, my next base set up, I'm going to try to, like, have my workshop laid out a little bit so that I don't have to, like, crisscross back and forth across the workshop so many times. Because I keep having to, like, zip around in here. Feels possibly like a bit much. It's not efficient, you know? We all know how efficient I like to play games. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Computer chips. I need... Oh, shoot. I didn't make anywhere near enough gold. Oh, wait. Yes, I did. Okay, and then I need 60 of these. So that's, uh, what? 600... Brain no work. Was it 630 I need? 15 times 60. My brain won't work right now. Hey Siri, what's 15 times 60? Siri's ignoring me. Hey Siri, what's 15 times 60? It's 900. Oh, I was so close. <laughs> so close, but so far. 900? You gotta be ki That can't be right. That can't be right. I'm sure it's right. <laughs> you need 5,000 power, which is the which is the biofuel generator. Uh, unless I can connect up two of those... You connect up two power wheels? Two of the p -p power wheels? These only produce 2,000, I guess. What? No way. Nobody got time for this. Don't you attack my stuff, you jerk. God. You say that now, but your next base gets even bigger. Oh, it's gonna be bigger. I, I can't. I can't help myself when it comes to these games. Oh, I can't pick it up because I got that equipment on my back. Uh, I need to leave the equipment behind. We'll stash. It. Oops. Jeez, can't even make my way through the door. What am I drunk? Uh, we'll stash the equipment in here that we need for the mission. So I don't want to lose those anyway. Go, dog face pony boy. I wasn't saying the base would be smaller, just that I would try to lay it out in a way that it was a little bit more conveniently located. I mean, I guess if I already have a sense of, like, how many benches I'm going to have, I could make the space a little, little bit better laid out. Considering we started with just this and then I expanded all the way over to here... I've been trying to keep this over here as, like, my living quarters area. Not that you really need to, but... I don't know, just for aesthetics. Alright, how are we doing chip-wise? Oh, I need epoxy for chips. Ah, dang it. Of course I do. I need 120 epoxy, no less. That's gonna take a bit. Uh... I need... Wow, I need sap and sulfur. I don't know if I have, uh... Sulfur hiding anywhere else. We're gonna have to go harvest some. 
Right now I have enough for 17 chips, and I need like 60 or something, I think it said. Yeah, 60. Isn't that ridiculous? Oh, come on. Who came up with those numbers? Run around burning my torch out, even though I got the electric lighting in here. Smirk that way. Alright, refined wood. That should be enough to make the repair bench now, I think. Oh, I forgot the leather outside. <laughs> Five! Good job! I need, like, 20. <laughs> I can see this is going to take a hot minute. As everything in this game tends to do. Um... I have to go grab a stack of wood from outside. Make some more sticks. Pepperidge Farms, remember? Oh, I got sticks in here. Um, whatever. Make all the sticks, not just some of the sticks. So wait, if you do an enzyme extraction event. Yeah, I haven't done that yet. I mean, there's not really, like, a direct need to do it, aside from, like, it's something you could do. It's not like I needed it to progress or anything. <laughs> so you're saying this uh, this thing takes 5,000... No, that's 2,500. Yeah, it is going to suck a lot of power, isn't it? Which means I'm... I'm I'm gonna need like another water wheel, probably. I'm hoping the water wheels can connect together and then it's, you know, doable. Oh, I need electronics for that too. Of course I do. Of course I do. Why, why wouldn't I? I mean, it makes sense. It is, you know, producing electricity. It's probably gonna require electronics, but you know what I mean. I'm gonna need 10 steel ingots, uh, and I definitely don't have those crafted, so that's gonna be a thing we have to do, too. Uh, I can grab this stuff now. Steel bloom. Slap them in here. Sorry, the generator produces 5,000 power. My bad, my bad. Do you have bones? I have some bones. I've used a lot of bones to make, uh, uh, to make crushed bone for epoxy already. Um, we might have some more up here on the animal murdering bench. These need to go outside for leather anyway. Slab that on there. Um... I have no idea why I'm running around with an iron ingot on me, but I have one. Oh, I know why. I grabbed them to make, uh, uh, steel bloom. So we'll grab that and stick that in you now. Have I got the carbon fiber in the wrong place? No, it's definitely... Oh, wait, it's already finished making it. That was quick. Just short the electronics now, which is going to take a fair amount of copper, I can see, since I need, like, nine freaking hundred. <laughs> Seventeen. Okay, we're, we're going to have copper problems. We're going to have to go find some copper. I might even need to put down a little copper mining machine somewhere. I got bones in here, too. Look at all the bones. We, we got bones coming up everywhere. No copper in there. No copper in there. I think we're, uh, we're gonna have copper problems. Got so many things in so many different benches, but... Copper we don't have. Get all those going. Time to mine, yeah. The uh, the ridiculous the copper consumption really is crazy. Considering the gold wire only takes five, it is a little weird that the copper takes so much. You know, um, I can't remember what deposits I had in. Uh, this is empty, I think. Anyway, yeah. Let's take this. 
I don't remember what deposits we had in this mine over here that's close by. I'm going to go take a peek. Um, I know there were some large deposits in there. I just don't remember what they were. I don't know why I have a sponge on me. <laughs> Destroy it. Destroy the sponge. We're going to need fuel for this sucker too, I guess. Boop, boop. I guess I need to restock this thing to make more fuel. Balance issue? Copper's usually more abundant. Yeah, it is. You're right. It just, uh... But when you have to make, like, 900 copper wires to make electronics, to make one item to craft things, it is kind of like... It's a little weirdly lopsided. 900. I don't know why I have curtains there. I guess I crafted them and then never put them up. Okay, we got those. I need to make a I need to make a torch. I gotta get sulfur. Steal a little bit of this now so I can make a torch quickly. Game won't mind, I'm sure. Oh shoot, I need fiber. Didn't I not grab the sulfur? What's going on here? There we go. Add. It's a lot. It's a lot. Steel is also a problem for concrete builds. Oh, yeah, because you need steel rebar, don't you? Wow, I hadn't even thought about that. Thanks for, like, causing me some early depression before I try to move on to doing that. It's greatly appreciated. Fiber I don't need in here. It's getting a little crowded in here. I gotta set up, uh, like, some of their... Food to get my third food buff too, I guess. What could I make that I've got that's gonna go bad anyway? You know what? We can make more of the watermelon fruit salady type crap. Uh, if I can remember where. Yeah, here, here it is. Fifteen fruit salads. Why not? He's now gonna be prepared. Yeah, I'm gonna be stockpiling steel for a while. I think when it comes to like having to make that rebar. Trying to hear the stream through living on breathing instruments. Ooh, RSV and Rona kicking your butt. Oh, sorry to hear that, Britt. I know that can be brutal. Hopefully you uh, you make a swift recovery and get back on your feet again. The old double whammy. You know what's torture? Completely unrelated to that. <laughs> I was playing Apex Legends the other day. Just for something to do. I needed to unwind. I was playing a little bit of Apex Legends. And somebody had their microphone on like an open mic. And didn't they start singing Creed? And now I've had Creed in my head for like three days. That's not fair, man. It's obviously not anywhere similar to the situation somebody else is dealing with, but I've got, like, how, how do you get Creed out of your head once it's in there? All I can hear is Scott Stapp. <laughs> it's killing me. Why is it always the stuff you don't want to listen to that uh, gets stuck in your head and you can't get rid of it? Why is that? There's got to be a reason specifically why. Why don't those stack? What is going on? You know what? This game's just trying to mess with me now. That's what it is. Oh, I should probably put some spoiled meat in that deterrent thing outside here, too. Bloop. There we go. Am I a creep? <laughs> that's Radiohead. That's not, uh, that's not Creed. I like Radiohead. I could listen to Radiohead all day. I'm a creep. I'm a winner. The hell am I doing here? You can remove Creed with a bullet. I mean, I want to survive the experience. I just want to get rid of it. Hey, Brittany, how you doing? Can you can you take me higher? I should start busting it out so you all have to suffer too. Be like, take that, you jerks. 
All you jerks for supporting me. <laughs> Wait, why can't... Oh, it's still grabbing. Never mind. Uh, all right. I guess while things are doing what things do, um, we should probably go and gather... Oh my god, here we need we need food buffs. Let's go check this cave. We'll see what's uh, see what's up in here. Whether we've got access to copper in here. Great, thank you. You're welcome, Captain. You're welcome. You even like bust out there with arms wide open. <laughs> Way, way back when I was like, I don't know, 19 or 20, I went to Long Island and I was at this bar. Uh, I guess I couldn't have legally been drinking. But we weren't drinking, but we were at a bar. It was like a college town on Long Island. And uh, we went to the, there was a, a live show at the bar and it was, um, it was Creed and the Gandarvis. It was a little bar. I don't remember any of the Gandarvis' music, but they were playing. <laughs> like forever ago. It was before they got to be big, though. Before Scott Stapp showed how full of himself he was and what have you. Uh, this is iron. That actually could come in handy. But not when I'm after it. Oh, this one here looks like copper. That's aluminum. <laughs> okay. Ow! You little son of a so-and-so. Okay, we got aluminum and iron in here. Both both good things, but just not what I need right now. Dustin with a 24-month me member message. Remember me, millions of peaches. Peaches for me, millions of peaches. Peaches for free. Peaches come from a can. They were put there by man. In a factory downtown. Is that the Gand Artist? <laughs> Alright. If I had my way, I'd eat peaches every day. I thought there were two caves in here. Why is there only one? Can't even place a Creed song on my head right now. Oh, yeah. So, like, uh, their, their big radio hit, I think, was higher. Can you take me higher to a place where blind men see? <laughs> I guess there is a. I thought. Oh wait, is it up above? No, we're already up above. I thought there was two caves in here, but the lighting sucks and I can't see. So I'm gonna go with no. I'm wrong. I know there were some underwater, right by my base. We can check those, I guess. What a terrible band. I mean, it was the era. Like, they fit right in at the time. It didn't take them long to become dated, because they were the same as basically every other style of band in that era. Oh, sorry. Oh, you didn't die from that. That's better. Never knew that was the lyrics. Oh, yeah. It's, uh, yeah. <laughs> Classic. All right, well, I'm going to have to go into the ca into the underwater caves to search for one of those copper nodes. So let's, uh, in the meantime, just go up here and we'll grab some sulfur. There should be plenty of sulfur, I think, up here in the, um, oh, actually. We'll get some of this while we're at it, too. Um... There should be plenty up in the crater that's up here near where my dropship is. I seem to recall her being a bunch around there anyway. Whether I'm correct or not is another matter, but... Oh, there's salt here, too. I can grab that, too. <laughs> Don't build flashlight. Lighting sucks. Yeah, I just stick with the torches, because you have the torches on the belt anyway. All the lights that I've seen in this are really not very... enlightening. And the directed light is tough because it's you're, like it's only shining like right in front of you. Rather you seem Creed to me than actually Creed. I don't know if that's uh, saying anything. 
<laughs> well, thanks, Brit. I saw them in Toronto too. So at the time, uh, I don't know at the time. I guess I was. I would have been like 21 or something. I did like Creed for a little while. And then Scott Stapp just couldn't keep his mouth shut. And he was all picking fights with other like singers from other bands about how Creed was the ultimate band and it was like the best thing that had ever happened to music. <laughs> I was like, all right, that's that's about enough of that. <laughs> Creed didn't get big in the UK. No, it was they got pretty big in the US, but only for they were only really got known for a few songs. I mean, they were they were more than a one-hit wonder, but their uh, time in the limelight was relatively short-lived. And the and the frontman Scott Stapp was just a pompous goof. He sort of like turned everybody off. He was probably somewhere like, remember that one time in Long Island? There was that dude who went around telling people he didn't like eggs. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Spent a lot of time telling strangers about my egg thing. Actually, I guess I kind of have since I've told all of you. And for the most part, you're just names on a computer screen. <laughs> I don't really know any of you. <laughs> never mind all that egg business. It never happened. Hey, one kind gamer. Choo Choo Lamp works pretty well, it takes animal fat to refuel. Oh. I mean, animal fat's easy enough to get, because I always end up with an overabundance of meat, just from my murderous ways. I can't really stop killing things in this game. You know, not because I need it, but just because it's there. So collecting animal fat, I guess, is fairly easy. So was Nickelback. Yeah, except unfortunately there are people in Canada who still like Nickelback. Look at this photograph. <laughs> Every time I do it makes me laugh. They got so much airplay in Canada, it's ridiculous. But they are one of the few bands that, and from Canada that actually picked up some, some degree of fame in the US. Oh, Carry On My Wayward Sons, that's a good song, though. Although, every time I hear it now, all I can think of is uh, the show Supernatural. <laughs> Bone unlock the critter entries the journal, you have to do a whole lot of genocide. Well, I guess that's true, we gotta slaughter everything we can see. I mean, I haven't been super worried about unlocking the critter, or the, all the, uh, the journal things or whatever, but... There's no reason not to. Storm incoming, let's go home. I like Nickelback, one of my favorite bands. I'm sorry, Jay. Not that I said bad things, I'm just sorry that you like them. <laughs> but I'm bump. They're one of those polarizing bands. You know, people really either really like them or really hate them. There's not really an in-between. Substitute the word photograph with potato. There's this meme that a lot of YouTubers like to use with each other. It's uh, from the music video of Photograph by Nickelback. But instead of photograph, they just change the word to graph. And it's got a picture of a graph on it. So when they're talking about like stats or whatever, somebody will bust out that meme. Look at this graph! <laughs> hey Ralph, I'm good. Thanks, how are you? Used to go to a place called Sundance in Long Island. Saw a lot of bands in the 80s there. Oh, yeah. Wow. I, it's my, oh, I was like, why is it so dark? Is my light not on? It actually burned itself out. That's better. I can see. Um, What did I need all that sulfur for? I don't remember. There's something I make with sulfur. Oh yeah, epoxy. So I got a certain amount I can make with the bones, but... Why did this all stop? Did I... I feel like I took something out of here. Okay, I don't know what I was doing there. Whatever. <laughs> Swear, when you open your door, you actually head... You're headbutting it really hard. 
Pretty much, because I just run through and I bang on the button as I'm going through, so I'm not really opening it before I get there. It, it really is kind of like just smacking it open with my face. But it's okay, I've got a helmet with a mask on, so... Worst case scenario, I shatter the face of the thing and then I asphyxiate to death, all because I was in too much of a rush going through the door. Which I'm sure is probably fine. Hawk with an 18 month member message. Evening Cryptic. Think this game needs ferals. Oh my god, the ferals. You know, I haven't died as much to ferals lately. I've gotten a little better at handling them, but they I still don't like them. They make me panic too much. What the heck did I need all the sulfur for? I know I needed it for something. Why was I collecting it? <laughs> Why is my memory so bad? Oh, I know. I was just it was the epoxy, that's what it was. Uh, I might have overdone it. <laughs> I got, I got a, maybe a little bit, a little bit over. I need more light over here. What's going on? Yeah, that's a little better. I put one electric light over here, but it wasn't enough really to light this whole area up when it's really dark. It's scary. I was scared. I didn't like it. I was too scared. I need more bears. I need a panic room. <laughs> Gotta hide from the tornadoes in my panic room. Well, that's why I couldn't combine this either. I think one of these are salted, maybe? Maybe not? Nope, they're not. Grown by prospect. Okay, that's what it is. Some of them are grown by me and some weren't. So they can't be combined together. That seems like a silly... Silly little thing. I mean, a snowstorm descending on us, but I keep being, uh... F I've been forced to take time off, so... Mistakes will be made! Oh, so many mistakes. Snowstorm, you say? We've had a little bit of snow lately, but it really hasn't been crazy. Oh, right, I need more copper. Ooh, sneezies. Um... What was I making? Oh yeah, this. Tree sap. I might need more sap for out here. I did. So we'll slap one sap in there. What the heck is that noise? That's a, that's a dark night out there. I can't really see much of anything. That's ridiculous. Oh, this needs fuel in it. Uh... What is that noise? Is that a loa? It's a track out here. I, I can't even see the dang thing. Oh my god, it's dark. There, oh, there we go. <laughs> I thought my torch was already on, but I had turned it off when I went inside, I guess. There. Get dead, buddy. Your bones will come in handy. Are you getting hurt out here? What's going on? Oh, didn't really mean to didn't really mean to get on board. Oh, his food's almost gone. Uh crap. Does he like berries? We'll try giving him berries. What horse doesn't like berries? Oh, oh crap. There we go. Don't say all of them, because I know it's true. I still haven't built this guy a roof over his little stable thing. There you go, you can eat now. That's right, suck those berries down. Wife just asked, is this guy live or just talking to himself? Oh no, I'm live. <laughs> they watched you live for a couple years and she thought you were talking to yourself this whole time. Well, in fairness, when I'm playing video games and I'm recording it, I talk to myself, so it's not really that different, I guess. <laughs> it's, uh, I don't know, there's this thing where you like you feel compelled to like fill the silence a little bit. I don't know. Probably sometimes people are like, God, I wish you would just shut up a little bit. <laughs> Berries in, mushy out. Yeah, well, it's something coming out. Alright, 
I've got the 20, uh, 20 leather I need. So that let me build the repair bench in here now. If I can find it. Rep. There it is. Kind of about time I had this. Does this thing take power? I didn't really even think about that. It does require power. 1500 power. That's fun. Uh, deploy. Oh, and it's big! Why is everything big? Alright. Let's take it over here. Oh, yeah. This one looks kind of cool. That's alright. Repairing, uh, repairing requires all associated materials as normal. An active electrical connection will allow tier 4 workshop items to be repaired. Oh, so I might not need an electrical connection, actually. If I can figure out where I put the repair bag. <laughs> One of these benches has in it somewhere. There it is. The bundle. Workshop repair bundle. Wait, how do I... Use to collect five workshop repair kits. Okay, consume. Okay, so I've got those. Now I can stick them here. Boop. And then... Can I, do I have to put the item in the bench to make this work? Knife. Oh, repair all equipment, repair all. Oh. oh, it just takes care of, wait a minute, why is the knife not there? Hold on. There we go. Unable to repair. Oh, are these tier four? Maybe that's what it is. Okay, I probably do need power then. Um, somewhere. <laughs> Somewhere I put the uh, the electrical cable. Oh, let's get the epoxy out of here. We can get that going. Oh wait, I didn't make the epoxy yet. Dang it! Um, where did I put the cabling? I know I have wires because I set up all the electricity in here. Where would I have stuck that? In my infinite wisdom, where would I have put it? <laughs> I literally don't remember where I put it. Um, I'm sure it's here somewhere, though. It's like it's called like the wire tool or whatever it is. It's not in there. I think you'd lose your head if it was not attached. You're probably correct. Um, my wife would seem inclined to think so too. Usually I'm like, honey, where's the whatever? And she's like, are you blind or stupid? And I'm like, both. Help me. Then it's usually, why did I marry you? <laughs> okay, I can go there. Somewhere. I put the wiring tool, and I don't know where I put it. Hopefully it's... It might just be like for you. I don't have any internet problems going on right now. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, Reddit. I should probably refill my oxygen. Check outside? Why would it be outside? It's not in there. Oh, maybe I put it in the forge? <laughs> of course I did! Why? <laughs> okay. Oh, look, I found Top Rider. Uh, I don't know why I would have put it in the forge, but that's where I did it. I are smirt. Totally found it all by myself without any help. Thanks. Copper wire. Okay, so I need this. Uh, boop. From here we can do... I can't do a node from there, I don't think. No, I can't pick that. I need a node outside. A node knows. There we go. Now the question is, did I just overdo it with the power? I don't actually know how much I'm consuming. I don't 
know what you were thinking, walking right by my house like that. Yeah, it is pretty cheap to make a new one, but I just didn't want to, because I'd rather spend ten minutes looking for something than two minutes making it. <laughs> it's like that, you know, when you're vacuuming, and there's that thing on the carpet or the floor, and you run the vacuum over it, and it doesn't pick it up, so you, like, you pick it up and you look at it, and then you put it back on the ground and try to vacuum it up again. Same idea. Yeah, it's the principle of the thing, yeah, the principle of the thing. Oh, uh, okay, let's try and repair my stuff now, because, I don't know, reasons. Repair, unable to repair. Why? Kit that repair most workshop items at a repair bench. Does it not repair this, these particular items? What is going on? What about my armor? Items to repair, unable to repair. Okay. I literally have to have it on me. Repair to the repair bench. It's using one of those repair things, but why can't I repair it? Maybe I don't have... Maybe it's not getting enough power? Maybe that's all the problem. Yeah, oh, it's only get, It's not getting enough power. That's what it is. Okay. So it shows the connection there, but it's not... It's not getting enough electricity. Blast. Dang it! <sighs> what do I need to make another water wheel? Ten electronics, steel ingots, copper nails. Uh, I might have copper nails actually in the forge out here. I need fifty. Of no, I don't. Okay, I've got iron nails. But about that copper I just took back inside. And turned into something. What did I do with it? Oh, I turned it all into wire. Oh, good me. I are smart. <sighs> Got 16 copper nails, but that's not enough. Okay. Uh, we might need to look at making a different generator. Because... Smart guy over here used up all the copper. Um, it's not there. What about in here? Biofuel generator. Electronics, copper wire, steel ingots, glass. So steel is the limiting factor there, I think. I can get the other stuff from the other bench. It's titanium. There's steel. I need like 20 of it though, right? 20. Must have 20 of copper nails in your machine bench? Oh, yes I do, thank you. God. Amaze balls. And then I just need 10 electronics. I can grab those from here, I guess. It's gonna set me back, but sometimes you gotta go back to go forward. And then hopefully I can daisy chain them together, because they don't have like a battery system in this game. Uh, it's also nighttime and I really should sleep and make it daytime. And there's no campfire. <laughs> Dang it. Well. I wonder if when you have an electric heater in this game, if that takes the place of the requirement to have a fireplace when you're trying to sleep. So I would presume I would presume the whole point of it is just that you can't be cold while you're sleeping, but turn that off and try to conserve wood for once. All power, same grid. Alright. Not yet, batteries are coming though. Oh, are they? Sweet. That's kinda cool. I like batteries. Oh, I ran out of... Is that the horse I heard eating, or like something munching on some of my stuff somewhere? I think it was my horse. Huh? 
Okay, uh, second water wheel. The first one I had to put pretty far away, so... What the... What the God's name are you doing here? That's a swamp creature! What is a swamp creature doing here? I missed. No, you're all shot. Get in the, the game too. Is that, is that what's going on now? It's coming right for us. What the heck just happened there? Why is the biscuit here? I can't pick it up. Blue ones will show up in the forest biomes as well. That's the first time I've run into that. Toxic demons will damage you when carried. I don't want that. I could just rot on its corpse for all I care. Oh, you know what? That's mine. Back off. Get your own dead animal. Hold on, I gotta clean up the mess I made. I kind of left a little bit on the ground. Don't want mom getting mad at me for leaving a mess. Oh, I'm cut too. Oh, <laughs> this one got a little, got a little chomped up already. More bacon. Oh, I didn't, oh, crap. I was going to pick it up, but I forgot I was holding my knife. Take it all. No, I can't pick this one up either. That's interesting. Killed his family and followed you home for revenge. Pretty much. It's alright. We were just helping to save the ecosystem or something. I have too many things on me right now. Uh, I'm going to have a problem with all this sulfur I have in here. So let's stick some of that over here. Because that makes perfect sense to store sulfur over there. Oh my god, that I want to stick in here. Bones can go in there. Oh, I got all that tree sap because I was going to actually make more fuel, and I forgot. Because my brain works that way. Put the bacon in there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's meat in here. I'm gonna grab this. We can put it in the fridge. I guess I could if there was room. Somewhere I have this volatile stuff for making explosives. I don't really remember where I put it. I put it somewhere. Oh my god. I cannot find anything in this place. Uh, I better make a bandage to get rid of that. Yeah. Do I have a chemistry bench? Uh, I can't remember if I've crafted it yet or not. Which sort of leads me to believe that possibly not. Because I don't remember crafting it. <laughs> Did say you need bones, right? Yeah, I mean I constantly need bones. Sort of a never-ending supply requirement. Um, I'm gonna put this stuff up here for fuel. Oh wait, oh, that's what's going on. I was like, why do I have that poison symbol? I thought it was because of the stuff I stepped in, but it's this noxious, crusted stuff. Maybe claim to gain silica. Humans will toxic to humans will get damaged. I don't even know how to carry it. I'm just gonna destroy it. I don't really care about the silica. Not worth getting toxicified over. Don't be so toxic, bro. Need more oxide in there. 
Uh, and here I need these things because they're for repairing my bow and stuff. All right, let's try and get this stupid generator thing put out here now. A water wheel. Did I put it in the kitchen? That's entirely possible. It could be anywhere. I never really know where I put things, and that is sort of a problem sometimes. You're not colliding. You just think you're colliding. Must be placed in flowing water. Now it's colliding. What is it colliding with? Why is the motor on the other side this time? That's weird. There we go. It's beautiful! Oh, never mind. Alright, whatever. It works, mostly. Except the wheels kind of go in the wrong way. <laughs> How does that... It's clearly just a, like a packaged animation, but... Pretty sure it's not supposed to spin that way. If I had to guess. We've defied physics. First principles thinking my butt. Okay. Now how do I connect these together is the question. Can, will it connect to this water wheel? I don't think it is, is it? I think I need to like connect it to a node. That does not work. Uh, all right, hold on. Fine. How do I un undo this thing? Or is that connected? I can't tell. I mean, it's all lit up, so I guess it's connected, right? Okay. Well, whatever. It's not there are two nodes overlapping. It, they're all they're all glowing. I guess cuz I oh, maybe cuz I'm just holding the tool. Okay, hold on. Maybe we have to go backwards instead of connecting from the generator. Maybe we have to connect from the node. And then node to the generator. But the the direction of flow, is that a thing? Hopefully not. Now it looks like it should be connected. Is there a battery you can check? No, no batteries. No batteries. Have a good night, Cryptic. Gonna go prop myself up. Alright, have a good night, Brit. Hopefully you feel better soon. Well, I have enough power now, at least, so that's a thing. Let's, uh... Repair workshop? What? Alright, repair all equipment. <laughs> Literally only repair one item. Okay, these other ones are not from the workshop, I guess. These are all iron and stuff, so that's fine. Resources required. Workshop repair kit one. All right, I fixed my knife. Hooray! Oh my god, that that took way too much effort. That was that was ridiculous. Oh, anyway, uh, what about my armor? Repair armor. Do I have to unequip it to repair it? No? Huh. Uh, huh. It's okay. It sort of works. That was weird. Break armor is too much effort. You don't need it anyway. <laughs> yeah, right. It seems like I have to have it on my hotbar in order for the game to decide that it's repairable, you know? First I gotta unequip it all too, I guess. I don't have enough of these kits anyway to repair it all. I've only got three of them left, but... Nope, still not. Alright, I don't know what the problem is, but I got it fixed anyway. Now, what's the um, repair workshop about? 
I guess, oh, I guess there's some workshops you can bring down from the station, isn't there? That's probably what that is. Uh, gun. What did I, I don't even remember what I had where. There we go. Okay. God, at least I did something right today. <laughs> I, got, I got some stuff fixed. That's already more than I did you know, a while ago. Uh, make more of that. If I get some more uh, iron ingots here somewhere, I can make some more... It's my titanium. Yeah. I'm low on iron, too. I guess I could get iron also. Oh, these uh, these are two other things I could have repaired. No, I don't have the, any more of the kits. I'll have to order more of those from a dropship, but... We've got the uh, the dong axe and the dong and the sen pickaxe. Can't go wrong with little dong axe. Need a repair kit from the station. Yeah, I know. I had them. I, I had the repair kits. They were in here. I just didn't... Uh, I wasn't using them for some reason. I, I don't know why. It's fine, though. Okay, let's go caving. Um, I want to see if we can find the, the copper node I was looking for. Barring that, I'll set up on an iron node, because I, I do need iron. I'll fill up my water while I'm here, too, I guess. I wish I had an underwater flashlight. I can't see anything. Helmet light would be great. Go fight a bear again? I haven't even seen any bears in this zone. Other critters, but no bears. Oh, uh, bears. Am I crazy, or was there another cave offshoot off of this somewhere? Oh my god, I can actually see. What the heck? I thought there was another underwater cave I had found before that branched off. Maybe I'm mistaken. I do have a memory like a sieve, so... Alright. the helmet light, you might be immune to cave lung. Yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't that be a thing? Incidentally, I, I keep forgetting all the time to bring, uh... Bring medicines when I do this stuff. Not even like I don't have the medicine thing crafted, I just... Haven't made any actual medicine to it. Oh, I've got iron in here, so that's a plus. Let's get this so we can get some of it smelted while I gather it. I seem to recall at the time I was in here, I didn't really need iron so much, I was looking for other things. I may have left a lot of There's copper there, nice. Kill mechanics, flip cars, or wipe the community, you don't go find bears. Are you really the fox we know? <laughs> Sorry, I really haven't been myself lately. I'm feeling a little a little off. Not really normal. It's being represented in a variety of ways, including my lack of destructive tendencies. <laughs> yeah, speaking of which, this stream's sponsored by BetterHelp. <laughs> no, just kidding. Definitely not sponsored by there. Although, if they want to hit me up, it's been a it's been a slim month or two. I'd take it. <laughs> Oop. 
Bloop. I should see what I can buy from the station. I haven't bought anything in a while. I know I need more repair kits. Um, we're going to be down here a while. There might be other things I could buy that would be useful, too. Oop. Where is he? Where's he at? There he is. Did he get me? He didn't get me. Suck it, lizard snake thing. Alien worm from hell. Wait a minute. There's exotics in here. Grab those. Ooh. Give me them Zotics. This better help people get depressed talking to you and say, yeah, yeah. What is this, a Green Day song? <laughs> They'll be like, oh my god, he won't stop talking. Make the bad man stop. Sulfur. Okay, so this one does not have a deep copper. I gotta find some deep copper. There's... Isn't there a scanner we can make that can help me find this stuff? I can't remember. It looks like a cave scanner, but I don't know if it shows you, like where deep deposits of things are. I don't think it's that deep, you know? Bloop, bloop, bloop. Uh, yeah. There we go. Oh, I jumped too far. Ah, uh, crap. Had the first hot meal since Friday due to outages. Really? Like power outages? One of the other YouTubers I know lives um lives down London way, and they were saying they were getting like all kinds of crazy power outages down there. They've not had any here, which I'm obviously not gonna complain about. Copper! Hooray! I found it! There's an advanced deep ore mine scanner available on the workstation. Oh, okay. Well, I got what I needed here anyway, so that's a plus. Deploy. There's a work machine. You better work when I'm not around or I'm going to be real irritated. Okay. Yeah. In the meantime, uh, we can check up here. Although it looks like I pulled up the bridges here already, or the stairways. I might have already actually cleared all this out up here. Ooh. Oh, perfect jump. That was that was splendid. Oh my god, twice. <laughs> Stop it, game. There we go. Oh, I don't have any more of those. I need this back, please. That's too steep, I can't walk on that. Very glowy in there. Get a glow up. Auto drill, is he gone? Yeah. <laughs> well, sometimes in games when you put down stuff that's supposed to work automatically, if you're not within a certain range of it, it just doesn't do anything. Okay, this is definitely cleared out. Probably why I picked up the ramps that I would have had there. I'm guessing.
I would think there would have been two caves up here, but I guess not. Alright. Well, we found a copper node anyway, so that thing's gonna do some mining for me. Uh, I'm curious what the rate of mining is. Eh, it's not great, but it's not awful either, I guess. Alright, we'll let that go. Check in on it later. Since we need a whole bunch of copper that I don't have, uh, we might as well go ahead and do the mission that I plan to do tonight anyway. Get that knocked out. Maybe we'll have time for a second one while it's working away. Red exotics are in the lava zone. Take their own extraction deployable. They need to be cleaned uh, at the residue cleaner bench, which takes power and water. Oh. Residue cleaner bench, because <laughs> there weren't enough benches already. They needed a residue cleaner bench. <laughs> They do work when you're not there. I often have to check back because it's not because it's full. Oh, I see. Okay. As long as it does its job, that's all I care about, I guess. Go to the lava zone again. It sounds great. Well, it's kind of a long run to get to the lava zone. There was some interesting stuff there, but... <sighs> okay, let's, uh... Wow, I got a lot of stuff in here. Oh crap, I'm out of space. Take all that stuff out. Uh, copper can go back in here. I have too much gold. I need, uh... I need to start building storage. I, I often just use all the benches for storage because there's just so many benches, but I think in this case I might not actually need one. Um, okay. Unable to request a new sample quest or operation. Oh, that's not what I wanted. It's the board up here I needed. Extraction. There we go. Shablamo! Oh great, now a storm's starting, so I can't go out anyway. Have I killed you before? <laughs> Maybe not, I can't even hit you. Alright, whatever. Those are warning shots, don't come back! Okay. Exotics delivered. Reward. 27 exotics. I'm waiting for one of those mission pods to crash into Fox's house. Wouldn't that be just something if it, like, smashed through? Because I think if a pod lands where you've been building, it actually just, like, goes straight through your structure. Just, like, destroys it on the way through. Which I feel like would be kind of annoying. Possibly. Icarus says dirt bikes called MOA. Slap in, uh, slap in two pheromone modules and they're dirt bikes. <laughs> I can't, I, uh, I want a real dirt bike, though. I don't want to ride a MOA. Have I tried riding the delivery pod? Uh, no, I think I did try to get on top of it the one time, but I wasn't fast enough. Oh, what a shot! Suck it, Deathwing. Long range, on the move. You're right, it's definitely not me, because I, I can't hit those shots. <laughs> nice shooting, who are you? Yep, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Scrooge McDuck. Ah, did he say too much gold? <laughs> Yes, launch pad, I did. Uh, 
All right, I need more of that. Steel bloom. I might as well put this in here. We can get to it when it gets to it. Alright, let's go on our mission. I've been meaning to do this, but I'm lazy and I didn't do it yet, so here we are. Portable beacon, radar. Alright, what do I gotta do? Triangulate the hidden base. Scan location alpha, which is in the swamp. Of course it is. Why wouldn't you be? I think there's a way into the swamp from right here, so we'll go over there. Oh, what day is it? <laughs> that thing's attacking the corpse I left over there. Didn't get it that time. Or that time. Should have quit while I was ahead. Yeah, it's still a storm coming. I gotta wait it out. Mm -mm -mm. Are there any ruses in the swamp? Ruses? What's a ruses? I think I'm just waiting now. More bones equals more epoxy. More epoxy equals more chips. Or electronics, I guess. How did I know Princess Bride? Ah, I, I have not seen Princess Bride in like 25 years. <laughs> so, I don't really remember it. I remember like snippets of it, but that's like it. I don't have a good strong memory of uh, the Princess Bride. I have lots of crushed bone. Why am I... Oh, I need tree sap. That's why. Somewhere over here I had more sticks that I had made to make more tree sap. Let's do that. Rodents of unusual size. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Thank you for the 51 month member message, Mr. McBald Spot, and the 51 months of support. 51 months, my lord, that's so much. Thank you. Extra biofuel can? I mean, I've got a couple of biofuel cans. I've got, like, up here I have, uh, I don't know, multiples? They're not ready, but I have them there. I gotta put some wood in here so I can make some fuel to fill up the cans that are in there. There we go. Give me them fuels. All right. Electronics. Up to 38 electronics. We're getting there. Slowly but surely we're getting there. Does the, uh, does the refrigerator in this game have more storage space than the icebox does? Steel ingots. Okay, I don't know if I have to defend anything when I'm doing the scanner, so I should probably bring my portable base with me. I don't need the wires. We'll leave those there where I can't find them later. <laughs> uh, I don't have the bed or the campfire on me because I left both of those in the... Uh, um, both of those in the volcanic biome, but that's alright. No more wood in here. Volatile substance. Oh, that probably was in the kitchen because it's it's expiring. Oh, you know what? I used the volatile substance before to make explosive rounds. That's what it was. I think they were in here. Where did I pick them up? Rifle rounds. 
explosive rifle rounds. That's why I didn't have it in a storage box somewhere. I forgot it actually, like, decomposed relatively quickly. Inert volatile substance. Formerly highly explosive substance made from locally found materials native to Icar Icarus. I don't know what good it is after it's inert, but... Oh, I need arrows. Oh, crap. Give me some of this. Wait a minute. Is this not where I make the arrows? Do I, are those in the forge now? Aluminum arrows, carbon arrows, platinum bolts, platinum javelin, steel javelin, old steel bolt. Man, there's too many choices now. What's a guy supposed to do? Flint arrows. There we go. Oh, I already had. All right, there we go. All right, so I need uh, sticks and leather. Leather, I definitely have lots of. Sticks, if I think I just turned them all into. Turn them all into saps, so I don't have any sticks left. Let's go with Super Chad. Build a deep freeze. Stores indefinitely and provides ice for the ice box, and there's a talent which increases inventory space on deployables. Well, I've already spent all my talent points, though. So I'd have to, like, unspend to go buy, like, those individual things. Here's the thing. I'm kind of lazy. Boop. The rest of the arrows can stay there. That's fine. I'll just leave the wood here, too. Oh, I already had wood over here. Oh, I'm so dumb. Alright, whatever. the wood can go in here. Actually, the rest of the wood can go in here, in the carpentry bench. It's gonna be night time, so I'm gonna, uh... Well, actually, it's not really in this... I'm just in the shadow of the building. Whatever, I'm sure it's fine. We'll just go. What's the worst that can happen? We get dead? Psh! I laugh at the face of dead. Ha 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 ha. requires heavy barricading. You'll need... Uh, you'll get stone jaws, needles, and bears on the first scan. Well, that's not cool. <laughs> Maybe I better make more bullets. Actually, I've got titanium. I might be able to make the hunting rifle now. Oops. Just wait till death laughs in your face. Oh, you know it's going to. Right around the time that it's killing me. Oh my god, I died to death. Hunting rifle's in here. There it is. Hunting rifle. 40 titanium, epoxy, screws, leather, refined wood. Actually, I have pretty much everything I need. Because uh, we got titanium in here. Boop, boop. We got the screws, a little bit of epoxy, a little bit of fine wood. A little song, a little dance, Batman's head on a lance. Uh, I need more refined wood, though. Time for a bath. A bath, you say? You should look at some talents. There's a talent that would give you an extra stomach spot. Yeah, someone mentioned that earlier. I don't remember if that was just not a thing when I started playing the game and when I spent my talent points, or um, if I just overlooked it because I was busy looking at other talents. But that added food spot could be handy, I suppose. A third food buff to boost up stamina and or uh, hit points would be pretty big. Uh, I need more gunpowder. Oh, the river. Oh, the bath, yes. <laughs> yeah, that was a cold bath, though. I didn't like it. I usually prefer a hot bath. It's more soothing, you know? Not into the whole cold plunge. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I should make more ramps too. I guess I only have one ramp. Definitely, definitely one ramp. I need fiber for that. I need the wood. Wood. Oh wait, I just took all the wood. Find wood's done. Okay. Fruit salad plus corn chowder plus one of the fish dish plus wine for the wind. Stamina for days. Oh yeah, I haven't made any wine in a while. This is not a very successful lush. Okay, we got the wood. Just need four epoxy now. I need to make wine bottles. The wine bottles are reusable too, right? Like you get them back after? I have glass here, I think. 16 glass. Take wooden barricades, spike walls, and hedgehogs. Man, I haven't built any of those things before. How the heck do you make them? You gonna make a splint? <laughs> Dun -dun -dun. Maybe I should bring the explosive rounds with me too if I'm gonna have to deal with that kind of stuff. Got my wine bottles. Where do I make the... Oh, here's the wine. Got the reeds. Got the bottles. I need the berries. Berries, I've got a whole bunch of in the fridge. Five delicious bottles of wine. Salt up some bacon. There we go. Five bottles of wine. 100% stamina regen. 125 max stamina. Not bad. Not as good as cooked white meat, but not bad. Actually, I should take this white meat and cook it. Yeah, I, I know where the uh, the talent is for the extra stomach space. I already looked at it earlier in the stream. It is what it is. Put the corn away so it stops going bad on me, I guess, too. Wasting my corn. Epoxy that lets me build this. Alright, so that can stay here. I think I can build a, like a modifier for that too, actually. I had one on that other rifle. Something on the alteration bench for the gun. Supplemental respiration. No, that's not it. Uh, rubberized, aerodynamic, calibrated, supplemental, repair speed, harvesting carcass, silencer attachment. Grant covert one when attached to an item. Plus 20% stealth, minus 15% received threat. Grant decreased speed when attached to an item. Plus 20% accuracy with shotguns. Don't care about that. Sniper scope, don't care about. Speed shots, 1. Plus 25% movement speed when aiming down sights. Plus 25% reload speed. Uh, 
Flexible frame. Minus 50% carry weight, plus 25% move speed when aiming down sights. Basic scope, plating, health regen, oh, that's for armor. Huh. I thought I had a, an attachment on that thing that gave it added. No, maybe not. Okay, well, let's make, uh... Maybe faster reload speed. Steel ingots, rope, and refined wood. I don't remember how much rope it was, but I'll improvise. And then refined wood. Is Cryptic Fo Fox gonna die on this mission? Probably. I gave all the berries to the horse. No, I didn't give all the berries. I just gave some berries to the horse. Where do we make the barricades? Is that in here? Those are railings and such. Nope. Not there. Not there. Literally no idea where to make them. Okay. Lightweight. Reload speed. Oh my god, it probably is. Oh, stop. Clear cube. It is for... Yep, you're right. <laughs> I are smart. I make the silencer. I don't know if that's of any real use to me, but I can make it. Flexible frame, lower carry weight, better movement speed. I mean, the attachments aren't great. I guess I guess I can make the silencer attachment. Two epoxy and eight for. Uh, I left epoxy in here. There we go, hunting rifle with a, uh, with, <laughs> with a... Hunting rifle with a silencer on it. It's not the fastest process, is it? Ashley, uh, Ashley's just not always here. She's got life stuff, you know. Things have been quieter on the channel lately, too, so I think, you know, it's just not as busy around. Much to my chagrin. Alright, um, oh, here's where the barricades are. So I can make the hedgehogs here. Medium wood hedgehog, or the scorp- well, this can make the scorpion hedgehog, obviously. I need a lot of wood for this, and a lot of rope. Let's make a bunch of rope. <laughs> four rope, okay, good. Wow, good thing I can make four rope. I need to chop down trees for that, though. Oh, the campfire's off. Keep forgetting about that. What I really had to do is just put a fireplace on the second floor here, so I don't have to keep running downstairs to do that. Put 
to stack them vertically. Chase pair credit card. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it's not that. <laughs> I think it's just people just get busy doing other stuff. Can't always be here. You know how it is. Life, etc. Alright. Hunting rifle. It's nice to have the decent rifle now, finally. Can fire more than one shot in a row. In a row. Uh, I have a second bow that I left somewhere. Oh, it's in the, um, the bench out here, isn't it? There it is. Just it's just one's just a long bow, but it might not hurt to have a backup bow just in case. In case I like wear out the first one. Uh, we're gonna have to get our hands on some wood because I need to make some of those fancy spike things. Hedgehogs. Wow, it takes sixty wood each. How heavy are these things? Two kilograms each. I mean, it's not crazy. I need a whole bunch of wood, though. Take a research the barricade blueprint. Where is the... Well, let's see. Tech tree... Barricade, you say. I don't even know what tier it would be. Probably tier one for the hedgehog, right? Maybe not. Uh, oh, there it is. Wood wall fortifications, walkways. Wood spike fortification. Is this what you're talking about? So not a barricade, but the, the, the spike fortification? Is that what you're referring to? Those are made of the crafting bench. Or is there actually one called Barricade somewhere? I wish they had a search option in here. Oh god, they do. Jeez. <laughs> that worked great! <laughs> Didn't do anything! Yeah, let's just look for bar. Steel bar building trim set. I see what it does. It just highlights them in the different tiers when you type it in. Now, that's kind of not helpful. <laughs> Be way better if it actually took it where it was. Instead of having to like flip through and look for all the highlighted things that might match your, your query. Bone shield. How does the word bar? How does that get found in bone shield? I see nothing. Nothing. There's no barricade. Let's see, it's got it's got to be the spikes you're talking about, right? Search exists, but it doesn't use. Yeah, I mean it's there. This is something wood spiked fortifications. I guess that's what I need. To be mounted to fortification walls. Oh, I gotta build fortification walls though to do that. Oh my god, I'm not building an entire fort over there. Screw that. We'll just wing it. What's the worst that could happen? We get murdered? <laughs> We're probably gonna die. That's alright though. I gotta get trees. Need some wood. I can at least put hedgehogs down. That'll help a little bit. Let's actually see if I can have an upgrade I can put on this axe if I have more money. Oh, 
until I chopped down the tree, I wasn't even hitting. It's the power of the Platinum Max. You can hit a tree next to the tree, then it'll uh, still knock it down. Raw power. Oh, oh, oh. How dare you have a life outside of YouTube? What? <laughs> exactly. Thanks, Lepi, might be in the past. <laughs> yeah. What do you mean you aren't, uh... You can't be here volunteering your time literally every day. <laughs> well, literally every day I stream. I've been pretty erratic with my streaming lately. I think all the darkness is getting to me. Maybe I got one of those, like, sads lights or something. I just scrolled past it in tier two. Well, their fortifications are here, but is that what you're talking about? Because it there isn't something called barricade. The hedgehogs I already have. Like these are the defenses right here. I don't know. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Should play Long Dark. Great game. Yeah, Long Dark is a good game. I played that. It's a very good game. They sent me a poster actually um, when Crossroads Elegy came out, which was episode three for the Long Dark. They sent me a poster that had like all the dev signatures on it. It's kind of cool. It sits next to my desk here. Suck it, Drac. Oh, I can't pick up the body because it's... I got the equipment on me. Oh, hey guys. You hear about my extended warranty? They're spawning in because of the corpse or something. That was weird. I gotta play Power World? That's the intent. I actually, um... Oh, I don't have any inventory space. Uh, I'd actually reached out to the, the game developer, or the publisher, I don't remember which it was, uh, to see if I could get a copy of the game so I could check it out a little ahead of time. But I did not meet with success. They haven't replied. Uh, otherwise I would have already been playing it, actually. I kinda, it's my own fault. I kinda slept on that one. When I first saw it, I was like, uh, okay, well, that looks kind of weird. I don't know if I'm gonna be into that or not. <laughs> and then I started seeing gameplay, and it was very different from what I was imagining it to be. And then I was like, ah, oh, crap. Now I, now I missed an opportunity. How big are these hedgehogs? I've never, I've really never used these things. Well, they're not that big, actually. I'm gonna need a lot of them. I'm gonna do anything useful anyway. Uh, another Drac. What are you doing there? Don't mess with my stuff, you jerk. Problem is, these things are gonna keep drawing more enemies out. I'll get rid of the bodies. Tag said something about their website. Yeah, so I'd gone to their website and, and sent, and there was an email there about uh, creators submitting a request. So I used it, but I, I haven't heard back. So I, I don't know. They did say on there that if the demand is too great, they may not be able to honor all requests or whatever. And I do know like, from talking to a couple of other creators that um, they did reach out proactively to some people to uh, to offer them a key to play the game a little ahead of time. It comes out on the 19th, so worst case scenario, we'll play it on Friday. It's only like two days away. Just as a creator, it's always nice when you can get it a little ahead of time and get the, the opportunity for some view traffic. What the heck? I can't walk. 
going on here? Are these damaged? There we go. <laughs> like, I'm gonna walk up the stairs properly. That was super weird. But yeah, it looks kind of cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check it out. Just tuning in after another live stream went kaput. Oh, hey, Jason. Looks to be whoever's live stream went kaput, I guess. Uh, Lord knows if that's happened to me enough times. Alright, I need some fiber so I can make some more rope. Uh, we'll throw this in here. Whoa, there's like a battle royale going on over here. Oh, maybe not. They're all clustering around the corpse. And then this guy came in and just... Target of opportunity. <laughs> Pacific Drive looks pretty good, fairly deep. Yeah, I played the, uh, I got a preview build of um, Pacific Drive. That comes out uh, the same day that N uh, Nightingale comes out, actually, on the 22nd of February. Which is horrible for me, because I really want to play both. <laughs> so, uh, I will be playing it. The little preview build we got that was, um, they've already revoked the keys for it. They were only valid through the 16th. Uh, but we'd already, like, gone through the, like, the, the planned content in the game. Like, the story or whatever you want to call it. Uh, the first time I streamed it, you could continue free playing after that, but it was just, it would have just been like gathering things and like upgrading the car and then having to start all over again when the uh, game comes out. So, uh, what the heck? Why is it? Oh my God! Stop hitting me! I'm trying to like talk. Stupid bird thing. Leave your corpse there. That'll show you. Anyway, we'll be playing Pacific Drive. Uh, definitely going to be playing Nightingale. And Shrouded comes out later this month, next week. I actually took uh, three days off next week. So I'm off Wednesday, Thursday, Friday next week. Going to be streaming during the day to play in Shrouded. Take the day off and play both that day. That is entirely my intention, actually. <laughs> the track, the real hard part for me will be which one to play first, because uh, I'm looking forward to both of them, and I I've had a chance to, to try out both games. Uh, I can't talk about Nightingale because it's under NDA, so I can't give you any details. But I haven't had had a chance to play it. I posted some screenshots that I had uh, approved on uh, Twitter, X, whatever. Um, so I have played both. Looking forward to both. Twenty-four hour stream that day. Well, I don't know about that, but we'll definitely be streaming a bunch. I'll st I, I won't be able to go straight through the whole time because I, I, you know, I got family and stuff, right? So um, I'll start in the morning. Most games I find on Steam end up being available at like 10 a.m. kind of thing. So if that's the case there, we'll start at like 10 a.m. And I'll play through until like mid-afternoon when the kids come back from school. And then we got to deal with family stuff and food and all that kind of junk. And then I'll have like the night stream. Okay. I'm done. I'm done dragging my feet. Let's go get ourselves killed. Food? Who needs food? We got food. Oh, you mean uh, that night? Yeah. <laughs> well, I have to cook dinner for the family, so it's it's not about not about me eating so much. I can do without food. I like food, but I should probably do without it a little bit more often. Did I make more bullets? 
Not exactly. Sh shoot. <laughs> oh. Why do I forget everything? I thought I was gonna get like two missions done today, but I've spent so much time like petering around the base and like gathering materials and like working on upgrading benches and stuff. Probably only get one mission done. If I if I don't get myself killed. Daughter, you will eat your peas by the computer. Stop crying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. You shut up and put the food in your face hole. I posted a couple videos from Nightingale on the uh uh, in the Discord, uh, IGN got an early preview that they were actually able to do recorded content for. So I, I stuck those in there for people to check out. <laughs> lay off the food. I do need to lay off the food. I'm actually contemplating trying one of those three-day uh, three fasts. Just out of curiosity. Oh my god, this, I forgot how slow the gunpowder crafts. Okay, well we've got 40, 50 some odd bullets, I've got almost 100 arrows, eh, it's probably fine. I did pick up the bullets, right? Yeah. <laughs> Just have McDonald's delivery. Mess with me, horse. I'd break my own horse, but I'm afraid I'm gonna get killed. Now you're starting to get insulting, Joseph. I don't like that. <laughs> Yeah, it's funny that they call it a fast when it really is kind of slow. It takes a long time. Uh, okay, we gotta go over here. Wait, why is there a red ring around here? That's where my base is, but I don't know why there's that red ring. I fast for about 10 hours, does that count? It's still fast. I mean, you break your fast every morning, right? I remember when I was in school a long time ago. I don't remember how old I was. We did the, uh... It was like a 24-hour famine or something like that, I think it was called. It was like... 24 hour fast. For like, as a fundraising thing. I remember the yeah, being exceptionally hard, but we stayed up all night too. We didn't really sleep. We were playing video games and stuff all night. We should have been all asleep so that it would have gone by faster and like been completely unnoticed. Yeah, back in my day, we didn't have toothpaste. You want to clean your teeth? You want to bag a knot on a tree. Your teeth were black and pitted and cracked. That's the way it was and we liked it. Self-raid, just only me. <laughs> well, thanks for the raid. I appreciate it. <laughs> this is the swamp area, yeah. So we're uh, we're over here right now in this swamp. There's a second swamp over on this side. Not far from where we have to do our, our little scan thing of a bomber doer. Hopefully this guy's voice pipes up when I'm in the right area. Oh, here we go. You made it to the area. You made it. Get searching. What am I searching for again? 
Uh, let's see. Let's do a little buildy building. Can I put this here? Will it interrupt me putting down the thing? I didn't... <sighs> I didn't pick up all the hedgehogs. <laughs> I made like six more of them or something, and I, after all that trouble to gather the supplies for it, I didn't end up picking them up. Is this... Do they gotta face a certain way? It looks like they do. That exploding noise. Don't say explosions. I know that's what it is, but... Well. Not exactly as I planned. Uh... How do I swap out the ammo? Oh, there we go. That's easy enough. Gee. Dun -dun 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 -dun. This might go really bad. <laughs> Press E in Good. We're reading the station. It's active. Really wish I hadn't forgotten those other spikes. go with the exploding rounds. Oh, I think I damaged my own wall. body. <laughs> look at them just destroying this stuff. I have to craft another one of those things now too, I think. Was I taking explosion damage off my own bullets? Was I just too close? Yeah, I guess that's what it was. I, I, I AOE'd myself to death. I'm smart that way. I was like, this, this will just tear through this thing. This will be great. Nope. Stakes are made. All right, well, everything went according to plan. I have no tools or anything now, because that's just the kind of smirt I am. Uh, how do I get more of that thing? Open the escape menu and request a mission resupply if your mission equipment's lost. Perfect learning experience. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, I'm gonna need something to put in my gut for the moment. Oh, you know what? I already got these. Perfect. 
We gotta grab those, uh, little hedgehog things. I made eight more of them, and I didn't get a chance to use them, because, you know, hashtag smart. Uh, I probably am gonna need replacement walls, because I screwed that up. Stone frames. Pick two of those, just in case. Uh... Ah, crap. The nails, I think, are out at the forge. Yep. I think I might need leather, too. <laughs> I need stone! Oh, wait, I have stone in the uh, cement mixer. Da 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 da! Better with wood wall fortifications with stack walls. I mean, the stone was holding up until I started to explode it. That that was maybe not my my smartest course of action. <laughs> if I had to guess, I'd say that might have been a mistake. Ramp roofs and stuff are fine. <sighs> Alright, let's go back. I gotta get all my stuff. I need I, all my, like, my canteen, my oxygen tank. Like, all the good things are out there. All my weapons. So let's not fight on the way, because that would suck. Good night, Michael. Maybe a mode of napalm would help. <laughs> yes, yes it would. I have a few more of those hedgehogs now, but I have a feeling they're not really going to do a ton of damage. So stone jaws, eh? So they they're they look like they're weak on the on the bottom half of them. But when you're up on top of that structure, I can't really shoot the bottom, can I? Now find ways to cheese it. I never cheese anything. Ever. You know, except for when I want to cheese it. Exploding shells just make me think of Mario Kart. Well, the, the exploding shells might have been a mistake on my part. They were... They were problematic. They definitely did more harm than good, let's just say. I wonder if they, like, made a point of destroying my entire structure, or... If they limited it just to the enough stuff to get to the scanner. Two exploding shells do oh nothing. <laughs> I don't know why I was I wasn't thinking about the AOE of them all, but you know, whatever. It's not like people aren't routinely wishing for my demise anyway. I just fulfilled your expectations, that's all. Seems like the explosive ammo is more of a ranged ammo than an up. Yep, definitely is. Definitely don't want to be using. But I was hoping it would, with those uh, rock jaw guys, it would like smash through them a little better. I mean, it did. Killed the one. Also did a lot of damage. Oh, good. They didn't destroy the whole thing. Water, oxygen. Oh, we're pros now, practically. <laughs> Look, oh. <laughs> okay, I guess I could stay there. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah.
Oh, they've got Scoria. That's interesting. Huh. And I learned something today. Today. I wonder if it would be better to have walls in here with windows and just shoot out the windows of these things. Being on the roof might the angle might be kind of bad. It's safer up there, but with those things. I just know it. Okay, let's swap to the, uh, non-explosive rifle ammo. <laughs> Run into it for science. Is it, this is the first scan, yep. Wait a minute. It doesn't have the placement thing here anymore. What now? They moved it on me. <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Oh, I gotta like, these are a pain to pick up too. The spikes look just high enough to emasculate yourself on. Yeah. <laughs> well, those uh, those rock jack guys are uh, relatively short, so they're the right size for them. Oh yeah, alpha scan is complete. I guess it, I got lucky and they it finished scanning before they could destroy the machine. That's too funny. I really didn't think that was the case, but. Yeah, I'm not gonna complain about it, I guess. But now I gotta go all the way over here. That I'm gonna complain about. We get drunk on wine, the whole game will be better. Yeah, I got super lucky. I might have died, but success was still in the cards, baby. Nothing like, nothing like succeeding by failing. That's a real skill right there. No, I didn't bring a bed. That would have been a too smart thing to do. But I guess I could craft one. We did see a bear. I didn't realize there were bears out here. And it killed me, too. Well, or I killed myself, because I did shoot it point-blank with an explosive round. 
But I didn't see the bear corpse there, so I think the bear lived. I had to guess. The <laughs> calculated effort. It was all skill. That was all planned. Oh, what the? We cut through a little cleft in the rock here into another swamp area. here. What do I need to craft a bed? I need fur for that, right? Fur and leather. I might have to kill some poor innocent creature. It's called failing upward. <laughs> it's the, uh... We're taking the, the producer's approach. Inventory's full. Crazy number of brambles, holy. <laughs> Level 74 swamp rope. <laughs> the swamp rope. Smells like a rat. Oh, I got him! <laughs> Didn't even see him when I hit him. Ow. Ow. Alright, we're almost there. These are aggressive, aren't they? Oh, I got my inventory to get rid of. I got a lot of stuff. Uh, I don't need two portable beacons. Display a map marker when deployed. Prospect is going to adjust the map icon. And I think that's uh, we only need that at the end point, right? When we find wherever this hidden base is, we got to put that marker down. I think we should add a lot more. Yeah, a lot more chainsaw would be nice. It's up to you. Uh, well, it can stack them up. Can I put it on top of there? <laughs> Think I can still start that thing if I put that on there? Probably not, huh? I need... Oh, that one's damaged, so it's its own unique thing. Okay, so now the problem is I don't know... Uh, I don't know which direction the critter's gonna come from this time. Oh, 
We'll try the same structure here. I don't, I don't know. I did more of the damage to it myself than they did, so with any luck, this is stronger than it looks, especially if I can repair it a little bit. I can repair this whole end of it just by whacking the top of the wall. <laughs> From this way. Oh, thanks. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Don't say it, don't say it, because it's so it's a long run to get back home. Or from home to get back here, I guess. Wait a minute, is my rifle loaded? Yeah. Keep that a little more handy. Is it gonna be the rock jaws again? I guess it probably will be, right? Yeah, I didn't bring a bad roll, and I don't have the fur to craft another one right now. I'd have to kill some furry creatures. Mammoths? Oh, I hope it's not mammoths. <laughs> <laughs> if it's mammoths, I'm in a lot of trouble. This little building's not going to hold up to a mammoth. Never mind multiple mammoths. I don't know if these things are running in here because they're part of the thing or they're detecting the corpses and coming for it because I killed that one drac. Attack of the stone over there. That's right, you guys fight it out. If you're over there messing around, you're not messing around with me. Complete! That wasn't too bad. This one was way easier, man. Although, I don't know what that is. It's probably just another drag, but... I think the corpses are bringing them in now. The fringe of the terror zone. Never thought I'd see it open up. I'm not sure if anyone knows the full story. From memory, this is where we saw the first signs of terraforming washout. Enough for the predictive algorithms to prove out we failed. I mean, would you want to live in a critter-infested swamp? Well, possibly not. Peace. And Komodos. That was anticlimactic. Yeah, we need to scan location Delta now. Who knows what'll happen there, but... This one was pretty easy. It took me longer to set up than it didn't actually do anything. Uh, I need to... Ditch some stuff. I don't need this excess stone. The bones are handy, but... What I really need is uh, fur off of these guys, if it's an option. No fur. It's called the bayou. Come on down to the bayou. Uh, these guys don't have fur, so I can't get fur off of them to make a bed roll. That sucks. All right, where's our? Lo oh, it's down here. Uh, this way.
Mostly just rabbits and rats that have fur in the swamp. I guess so. I suppose I could have taken their bones and their meat, but... Meh. This one was most likely bears. I mean, that first one had rock jaws and a bear. I mean, those rock jaws are pretty tough because they're all armored on top. Possums. <laughs> It's too dark, I can't see him. Yeah. Got him. Swamp skunk. <laughs> 19 fur. I'm one fur short of a bedroll. Also need for the bedroll. Oh, I need leather too. All right, well, I got leather here, but oh, get rid of the two iron. Grab the leather. Uh, I'm gonna need sticks, which I apparently don't have any of. Got friends. Oh, he's got lots of friends. All right, you know what? Actually, it's probably the same one. He was probably just tunneling, right? Bedroll. Where did it end up? Did it just throw it on the ground? Oh, it did. I don't think he's aggressive. Seems like the friendly sort. There's the scan location. I reckon this is the. You made it. Now you're gonna need to search the area. I don't want to search the area. What am I gonna do this time? Let's go this way.
Uh, honestly, this does take a little bit to set up. Can I fix this thing? I think I can. There we go. Should have done that before. It would have stacked properly. This at spawn point. Can I not? There we go. There we go. I don't really thrilled about doing this at night where I've got poor visibility, but. Actually, that foundation has the same durability as the wall, but I could put a wall right here in front of it now, right? There we go. So that and that end of things will be stronger, hopefully. Good luck. Well, I need a campfire to sleep, but I was able to set it as a spawn point. I don't have any rocks. I can't make a... Hold on. Alright, spikes definitely hurt me. <laughs> it's hurt myself. Can't see, cloud leave me. Oh. Okay. We're set. Ish. Heavy on the ish. How many bullets have I got? 37, because I can't really use the explosive ones. So, at least with the, the two foundations and then a wall in here, they'll have that end of the things that it's harder for me to see will be a little bit better protected. Let's see what happens. What happened? I clicked it, but it stopped. There we go. Looks like the unit's ready. Yeah, <laughs> your unit's ready. Uh, I, I, we don't want to use the exploding shells. I, I learned my lesson. <laughs> Unless I can shoot him from a distance, that's just not going to be worth it. Had to be needlers. They don't die quick. Okay, I had not anticipated that.
Reload. Scan's already complete, but I figure I might as well fix all this stuff so they can at least pick it up. I don't know much about terraforming, but I remember hearing about the first enzyme tests. Pretty volatile. By design. Trying to rework a planet. Uh, that's before exotics were tossed into the mix. <laughs> what a mess. There we go. I even fixed my hide. How about that? You know what? That wall I thought I put in there, I don't think it was actually there. <laughs> it's Keep the beacons if you have extra. Oh, I threw one away earlier. Oh, I put it in the ground. So it was there, it just was not anywhere useful. Oh, crap. Uh, any extra leather or fiber? As I pick up more fiber. <laughs> Where'd it go? A couple sticks aren't gonna matter. Light acid fog, I says Barton. Yeah, which way am I going here? Oh, this way. Holy. Storm incoming. Light acid fog in my butt. Oh, crap. Jaguars. Okay, I need that uh, fiber back. <laughs> you got to make bandages now. Come on, game. It's like it's out to get me. Great, I'm getting the berries, but not the fiber. That's awesome. I don't know how strong that, that uh, acid rain is, but we'll take a little shelter in here. Deal with my injuries. Acid fog is good for the skin, exfoliates. I bet it does. They stack in stacks of six? That's so lame. Oh, no! I need that.
Okay, so that's fine. Part of the problem is I want all the obsidian and scoria and stuff that I got off that one critter I killed. I guess I killed two of them, but... Okay. Wow. That was a dealer. I think he saw me. Holy, this fog is intense, man. Looking forward to the sun coming back out. I can't see anything. Get bent, you little jerk. Oh, dang. Take my arrows back. Thank you, sir. Upcoming fox jumps off a cliff or into a hole. Yeah, <laughs> just like barreling headfirst through the fog and just straight off a cliff. That 100% sounds like something I would do. I don't, have a, I don't know if I'll need it anymore, but uh, just making sure it was had the rifle loaded. Side. Smart place to build. What are you talking about? Is it in the tree? Oh! Hey, I want one of those! This looks all like indoor wood, too. It is interior wood. That's funny. They made their base all fancy like. Rain reservoir with nothing in it. I mean, they've got all primitive benches in here though. It's not like, oh wait, what's this? Medium iron crate. Damaged audio log. All done. Let's get that beacon down and transmitting and then. Black wolf throwing knives. Alright, we'll take those just because, I don't know, reasons. Oh, I can pick up the box too. Uh, I want that box. I need more storage back in my base, so that's like ideal. I don't need this extra stone. Worst case scenario, I can get rid of it. Well, I'll get rid of them. So the excess bones there, we'll pick this up. Don't need the iron hammer. Group of crop pots. This is a cool base, actually. I like this. Too small, because like there's just a bajillion benches, and Lord knows I would 100 percent fall over the railing. But the fact that you can build up in these big trees is kind of cool. Makes me wish I'd already done it.
Guaranteed I would fall off of this thing. The science stuff can happen. Yeah, like fall for science. I guess it makes sense they would have the carpentry bench here since they have all this indoor, uh, indoor wood stuff. Simple and durable way to collect rainwater. I kind of want it only because I don't have it. How heavy is it? Made out of stone, so probably pretty heavy. Anyone know what's making all that noise? Uh, place a beacon within the base. Okay. Deploy. Must be placed outside. Sounds like your paychecks just arrived. Sweet. Let's let's check it out. I wish I could actually put a name on this thing. We'll make it an orange tree. I can harvest the shrooms. Nice. Yeah, we'll just say that I built this treehouse. This was totally my design. I made this. My inventory's gonna be full, and I'm not gonna have it. Oh, already full. What are those seeds that are falling? I already don't... I have enough mushrooms growing back at home. I don't really need to worry about it, I guess. Uh, let's just go get whatever my reward was. I don't remember what it was supposed to be. If I don't bug him... Okay. Anyway, if I don't bug him, maybe he won't bug me, but... He doesn't operate that way, apparently. <laughs> Excuse me. Won't go away. Here we are. Good work, Prospector. Good work, Prospector. You may proceed to collect your reward. Quite the encrypted satellite upgrade from the Cenotai Supply. Ooh, is his pardon? Uh, I have too much stuff. <laughs> Not surprisingly. Uh, I don't really need the campfire. We'll leave that. I'll take this. Damn. They really do watch in their ranks. This here thing will decrypt confidential faction communications. Sweet. That means it'll get you into direct oh, contact Jesus. with faction reps. These don't get sent out very often. Go ahead and set it up. All right, we need to go down to here. A bit of a run to get home now. Hey, it's a mammoth! How aggressive are the mammoths? I can't even bother looting him if I kill it, though, so there's probably no point. I don't have any room in my inventory. Could Fox make it back alive? Probably not. <laughs> At least if I die, all I have to do is run out and pick my stuff up. They already did the work. I don't remember if I killed one of these or not before. I guess so. I didn't get a pop-up from the... Uh... Creature lexicon or whatever.
Is Radio Guy okay? He sounds tired, ill, injured, or some combination. <clears throat> I don't know, he sounded irritated in one of the earlier messages we had. He was like, this is bull. Old school is Chippa There's a mission to build your own treehouse. Oh, nice. Uh, we want to go here now. Actually, get to the edge of that mountain first. Extra beacon, keep it uh, useful for marking deep mining. Uh, yep, totally agree, but I don't have an extra one because I was not smart and I discarded it thinking I didn't need it. I don't know where I discarded it. Somewhere in the swamp, there's an extra beacon just laying on the ground. <laughs> I don't know exactly where. I know the hopping is kind of irritating in this game when you're watching, but particularly when you're running through the water, you don't get the uh, the turtle debuff that slows you down, and you don't use up as much stamina, so you can keep going at this the run speed longer. If you're curious why I was jumping all the time, it's it's not because I'm ridiculous. I mean, it's partly because I'm ridiculous, but it's not entirely that. Found a bramble. That was another uh, enzyme thing. So that treehouse was supposed to be where they're doing enzyme research, but they had all primitive stuff, so I don't see how they were doing any kind of research there. The thing they were researching is how fun it is to build a treehouse. Because you're used to Minecraft, that's what you're doing, Minecraft. Oh, is that what this is? Minecraft, alright. Okay, I'm picking up what you're putting down. Ah, wasted an arrow. Oh, I should probably check out the copper drill, too. We've had that going for a while now. Death birds must die. Dang it, can't see my arrows. <laughs> there we go. It was My Little Pony. Friendship is magic. We made good friends with that pony. Have a good night, Sleppy. We made it! Alive, even! Exit. Stage left, even! Alright, I've got uh, all my basey type things we can throw in here for later utilization nations. Got another bedroll. That's handy, I guess. Got a couple of hedgehogs. Oops. 
This is a really big storage chest. Uh, I kind of want to stick it somewhere. This is bigger than I thought it would be. Um, crap. I mean, it's most useful down here where I've got all this stuff, but it's also most crowded down here. Yeah, I mean, it kind of works there. Is it any bigger than this? Yeah, slightly bigger. A little bit more storage capacity. Um, let's start putting all this random crap in here. Sort it out later. I don't know what to do with the audio log. Place encrypted satellite upgrade into the contact forward device. Put this thing here? Yeah. Press to interact. Missing. There we go. Mission complete. There we go. Got my reward, too. Hooray! Now it's looking like bigger and fancier. It's gonna clip through my building. <laughs> Good thing it doesn't just destroy the building, because that would kind of suck. Oh, yeah, there we go. Alright, we can pick another mission now. So we got the, uh, unavailable, that one's unavailable in the world, but that's fine, because those are just those normal exploration type things. What have we got here? Retrieval. Locate the missing agents. What's that 50 red stuff? Is that like a different type of exotic? Let's go with Super Chat. The metal chest is safe to put outside. Oh, okay. Uh, extraction of rare ice resources. That's worth 300. Tree hunt construction. There we go. That's worth 200. Miasmic research. Well, it's got four skulls, so that's probably not dangerous at all, right? Research into toxic substances unique to the swamp. Where's tier four tech? 500 uh, exotics for that. Tempest retrieval. Huh. 50 red stuff. Red's the new exotic? I see. Maybe I'll take this crystal extraction mission. Collect the drilling equipment for the Cenotai delivery pod. Holy, what the... Oh, they gave me thermoses! Awesome! Like a canteen, but with better thermal protection. I could put coffee and stuff in there. They even gave me biofuel cans. Well, that's ridiculous. Can't believe they totally decked me out for this mission. Let's put that in here. Is this of any use at all, this log? What do I do with it? Can I put it in like in a, an equipment slot or something? Does it go into like one of these? Nope, what happened? That was weird. Nope, doesn't go in there. Literally can't do anything with it. <laughs> it's just hanging out. No, what your beacon is, I went back and looked if you want to know. Uh, I'd have to run all the way out there and get it. I'm too lazy for that. Eat it. Yeah, we'll just eat that thing. The communication module? Absolutely. <laughs> that makes perfect sense. Uh, oh, I want to put this rain reservoir outside. Stick it right over here by the door. Perfect. I mean, we're right by the lake and everything, so this is probably not going to be terribly useful, but, you know, whatever. At least it's fresh water where the other stuff's dirty. Oh, yeah, we got this thing on here, too. Quest items. I mean, I could probably just destroy the quest items, right? Oh, I can only drop them. I can't even destroy them. That's funny. Battlefield power drill capable of extracting super-cooled ice from Arctic areas. Super-cooled ice? What makes ice super cooled versus just regular cooled? I 
Oh, we got a beer bottle in here. Uh, I don't need the longbow anymore. We can put that away. Turns out I didn't need it at all, but at least we were prepared. Shovel, bonus pickaxe, sledgehammer. Sweet! Should probably consume these before they go bad. Reset spawn. Yeah, thank you. That's a good point. I had not done that. There we go. I totally would have forgot, so thanks for reminding me. All right, we knocked out on the mission. Got a little bit more progress. So I want to go check on the copper, and then I'll probably call it a night after that. Super cold ice plus steel equals cold steel. Very useful. Okay. So it's useful for making that maximum ice beer. It's dark down here. I don't like it. <laughs> what the heck is the cave? Did I swim too far over? I have a feeling I did. You know what we need is one of those underwater scooters like in Subnautica so we can zip through these things. Water wheel needs attention. Okay, we'll check. Might be clogged up with stuff. Use the Schwartz. I see your Schwartz is as big as mine. You adopted the dog. I was bold to it. Take back my arrows, thank you very much, Mr. Snake Lizard Worm Thing. Oh, fair amount in here. Probably should have brought fuel with me, but I'm not that smart. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, why didn't I bring fuel? Got a big time storm coming your way. Is that what that hurricane symbol there is for? It's just a little storm. It's still good. It's still good. That's the three day forecast. It's still a day out. So deep underground, my fluffy tail will be dry by then. So I gotta swim through water to get out of here, so there's not really any staying dry. Success. That is rather stomped. It was, oh, look how dirty it looks. Wait a minute. That was enough to clog it up. It wasn't even full. I don't. I don't get it. Whatever. Destroy. Do not need all these sponges.
There we go. Uh, consuming only drinks the water that's containing the sponge. You can use it as like a temporary canteen before you get one of your own. It's not like you eat the sponge, you just like drain the water out of it. So if it has no water in it, you get nothing out of it. Sweet. Okay, that's gonna smelt up. We got uh, more copper bars for making more copper wires. Wherever they are, copper wire. I keep working on the electronics and stuff. Uh, it is uh, just after midnight my time, so I'm gonna crash for tonight. But we did at least get the mission done that I wanted to do. Um, working on some upgrades to get some more stuff. We'll be able to get the metal processor the next time I come back. We're getting pretty close in the number of electronics we have there. Although I gotta make more steel screws, apparently, because I used some to make the rifle. But that's not too bad. Uh, and we got the craft, the uh, repair bench out, so I finally got to fix my stuff from the station. I should probably radio in for more repair kits so I can make sure I got all my stuff all spick and span, but uh, we can deal with that another time. Uh, but thanks so much for coming to hang out tonight. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the super chats and everything as well. I'm, as always, Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.